look good, y'all. Fast here with another video. Jake Paul versus Nate Diaz, man. Hey, we're just gonna react to the knockout. Um, Jake Paul won. I was watching the whole fight, so obviously copyright stuff is really hard with boxing. So I'm just gonna react to the knockdown real quick. And that was the knockdown. The left was killing Nate all fight. I'm so happy for Jake, man. I love Jake Paul. He's definitely one of my favorite uh in influencer, my favorite influencer boxer. I'm glad he won. I was sad when he lost to Tommy Fury. I'm a big Jake guy. Um, obviously beating Nate Diaz is huge. Probably saved his career. We got KSI versus Fury. Uh coming soon. I want that uh, Fury rematch for Jake, and then I want him to verse KSI. They said that's going to do MMA again. Um, I can't wait for that. But this was crazy. He was hurt. Jake was piecing him up. I knew Nate Diaz wasn't going going down and out like that, man. Let me see the knockout one more time, and then let me speak on uh, what I got to speak on. Oh my gosh. So that was a knockout in the fifth round, and he still made it all the way to the tenth. This fight went to distance, but it wasn't close. Jake probably won like seven and eight, eight rounds. Nate stayed up. You know, he had his stamina doing his thing. Drake lost a bet. Um, but Jake was with that West killing him to uh, cut the the jabs right between the gloves. And you just can tell he's a better boxer, man. It might be different in MMA. Nate Diaz is a dog. He's a tank. He doesn't freaking go down. He doesn't get knocked down somehow, some way after all the punches taken. But the left was too crazy. Jake got the one knockdown. Way more hits. Way more everything else. But definitely Jake's fight. And he won. I'm glad he won, man. Um, it was wild, man. It was wild, man. So let me know your thoughts on it. Make sure you like, subscribe. Appreciate it.